Hey everybody, Daniel here, and of course I'm joined by my son Adrian. Uh, so last night on the last drive-in of Joe Bob Briggs, uh, it was the season three uh, season finale, and uh, he wrote or he read a letter that I wrote to him last year. Uh, last year, and it was the episode uh, that they did um, Trauma's War and One Cut of the Dead. Uh, he just made this really inspiring speech. It's been dubbed, you know, keep rolling, and I don't know. It just, it just, it hit me, man. Like it, it just, what he was saying would resonate so much, and everything he was saying, it, it, it hit me because, you know, we actually released our film Unspeakable Acts uh, two years prior to me hearing that speech, but it was like, man, like he gets it. I don't know. It, it just after hearing him, you know, do that speech, it just like I knew I made the right decision. You know, we were up against all the odds making our film, and you know, a lot of times you just want to quit. You know, we're not filmmakers. I'm a factory worker. Got a kid here. You know, uh, sometimes you just, you know, you, you just think like, what's the point? No one's gonna see it. But you, you battle through it. You know, you 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 get it done. And after hearing the speech, I knew, you know, me and Simon made the right decision. You know, we we, we you know, through uh, against all odds, we were able to finish our film. And anyway, so that night when he when he did that speech, I mean, I got I'm getting goosebumps right now talking about it. It's just. It hit me, and so I had to write him a letter, and it was never my intention that you know it'd be a letter that I'd want him to read on air or you know anything like that. It was just more just I wanted to let him know you know exactly what his speech and what his show means to me, you know. And uh, so you know, last night as I'm watching it, and I'm just you know I'm live tweeting for everybody else, and boom, you know, we got a letter here from Daniel Richardson in Bedford, Indiana, and I'm just like. I was not expecting that. Very surreal. And then immediately following that, uh, you know, my Twitter just explodes uh, with everybody, you know, congratulating me and reaching out just to spread the positivity and people, you know, saying thank you, you know, or, you know, saying, you know, thank you for your words because you know the letter that you know he you know read for me, you know, apparently you know kind of touched some people as well. And then they also wanted to say congratulations on finishing your movie and you know when can we see your movie and all stuff and. Like I said, I tried to get back to every single person that, you know, reached out to me. If I missed you, I deeply apologize. Uh, like I said, I'm still trying to get through, you know, some of the tweets right now. Hey, buddy, you all right? Uh, so anyways, uh, I just want to take this time right now just to say thank you, Joe Bob. Thank you, Darcy. Uh, thank you, everybody at Shudder, whoever it was that, you know, handles the fan mail or whatever. Um, you know, can't thank you guys enough. And seriously, keep up the great work. I mean, the last drive-in is so special, not just to me, but to the entire horror community, the entire mutant family. Um, I'm 36 years old, and like, I don't live tweet anything. But you better believe I'm there every Friday night. You live tweet with the rest of the mutants. I mean, it really is just a special thing. Uh, what you guys have created just, I don't know, it, it touches so many people on so many different levels. And so, to be a part of that, you know, it's just, it's a great feeling. Uh, so thank you guys all for that. And then to everybody out there who, you know, after, you know, they dropped my name, who reached out to, you know, say something, thank you guys so much. Uh, so as far as, you know, Unspeakable Acts, you know, we released it three years ago. We've done some shorts since then. Uh, you know, some you can find on YouTube, some of them are just on DVD or whatever. Uh, we will leave... Uh, I got a little outro video that I put on all my YouTube videos. I will put it at the end of this video right here. It will have all the information on it. It also have all of our social media. So, uh, you know, I'm Dan Richardson, but uh, TPS Productions is, you know, all the stuff that we do, you know, movie related. So you can check it out there. Uh, right now, we're kind of, we got a little bit of DVDs uh, left, but, uh, you know, definitely not enough for what I was asking for last night. Uh, we will definitely be putting them back into print. We'll be uh, making off some more DVDs soon. So just bear with us on that. And uh, yeah, again, just thank you guys so much. I'm sorry this is coming off kind of long-winded. I didn't quite know what to say. Uh, I was not expecting any of this. Uh, Adrian's getting a little restless, so I guess that's, you know, we're going to go ahead and end it there. So guys, again, Thank you so much, and you know, just, just have a great day.